What's up and down and all around? I'm Grand Crystal Star, and this is another episode of Kirby Squeak Squad. In the last episode, we figured out that, that the Squeaks were actually behind uh, the robbing of Kirby's shortcake. And in response to that, DDD picked up Kirby, chucked him at the Squeaks, that somehow opened up a hole in the ground, and they all fell down a deep, deep, deep hole. And now we're suddenly outside. Logic! By the way, I also have with me today... MML, what's up? Yay, my first co-com in forever! Who, who knows? First Let's Play video in forever. <laughs> I know! <laughs> oh, I really need to get back into the swing of this. And this is exactly what this video is meant to do! Anyway, Yay! When we Motivated. last left off, we completed level 4, and now... On to 2-5! Let's go! Let's go! No, this is not the Mario series, MML. Matt, if that is yeah. your real name. Dun, dun, dun! <laughs> Alright, so in previous Kirby games, those little... whatever these things are, the thing with the eyeball, uh, they, they would normal... What? They give you burning. Yeah, they would normally give you burning, but since burning and fire are combined in this game, they would actually just give you fire. So... Yep. Helpful hints. What do you know? Yeah, Kirby Squeak Squad. I mean, other than oh. Superstar, Squeak Squad was like the first Kirby game to give you multiple moves with one power. Yeah. And, like, Superstar just kind of doesn't count. Because they kind of just abandoned that later. But then Squeak Squad brought it back, so yay. Something tells me that Animal isn't going to be the most useful here. I wonder why. <laughs> Alright, remember... Remember a few episodes ago when I said that you could freeze over lava with ice? Here's an example of that. Oh wait, I don't have the skull yet, I can't aim it, gosh dang it. But you can uh, stop fire spouts from actually spewing fire. So if you're ever in a fix with that, you can just, you know, freeze freeze a uh, fire, because that's a thing. Yep. It's been so long since I've played this game, I need to pick it up again. Oh, I know. Like. Yeah, see? Right here. You can freeze over lava and walk on it without any consequences. However, if you attack the uh, the blocks that appear after you do that, they will turn back into lava, so be careful of that. Stupid lava oh. in the way. Alright, let's combine a couple of these and get a meat! That works. That looks like the... Um, it, it's... Um, I, I'm, I'm being an idiot right now and I can't remember um, what it's called. Mutton. Mutton. Yeah. Ooh. Like the, um, and that's medieval times food. Also, nice, I got magic again. That's one of my favorites. Yeah, magic is the best. And like, it's it's not just a roulette anymore. Oh, yeah. Well, that did not go as planned. I did not mean to crouch there. Oops. You ain't gonna throw your fire at me, no siree. Get out of here. What are you and your... Like, oh, I'm hot can't resist me. I'm too hot to touch. Can't yeah, right. Oh. So cool, except not actually that cool. Yeah, I'm the cool one here. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> just... Somehow, like, enemies are immune to lava. I don't know why, but they are. Ow. Kirby, on the other hand, is not immune to bats. That's to be noted. Yep. He huh. is, in fact, allergic to bat. Yes, and death. Assault and battery! Whoa! Uh, hold on, I gotta take a freaking drink. Okay, we're back from this brief intermission. You know what? Screw these abilities, I'm not gonna use those. I'm going for magic, man. Magic! Magic! Oh, here's a, uh, like, an example of an ability I can actually show off for once. This is the mini-boss for metal. He, of course, can make rocks fall from the ceiling. He can roll at you and other things. He's very slow, making him very easy to hit. However, he has a lot of health, so be careful. Okay. I was trying to mix the words careful and wary. Careful wary. English, right? What is that? The language. That's right. Who speaks languages anymore? I don't recall whether you showed off metal yet, but spoilers, it's one of the 
um, not very useful power-ups in the powers in the game. Yeah, I, I haven't showed it off yet, but I've explained it, so... Yay. Maybe is it I... required at all at some point? I think it is. For a couple of the treasure chests it is, but not actually for any real part. Yeah. Maybe face the right way, Kirby, gosh. Out of the way! Birds! Okay. I, we... I love how birds can defeat a giant metal, like, monster thing. <laughs> I know! Anyway, this... Also, hovering sucks. Yes, it does. See how slow you fly as metal. And how slow you walk. Like, this is dashing speed. That's pretty bad. But, here's our first, like, real example of metal. Like, you see these, these gray metal blocks? If you press A, down, and B at the same time, you can perform a ground pound and break the, those blocks. Metal versus metal. Metal wins. Exactly. Like, wall versus wall? My money's on wall. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> listen to that ring. Ain't it just awesome? Yep. Another thing... Another thing to note with, uh, with metal is you are completely immune to normal enemies. Like, they won't hurt you. At all. Yeah. It's basically like... It's cool, except um, you move slow and that's annoying. Yeah, it pretty much sucks. Speaking of sucks... Parasol. I hate this thing. I actually don't mind it that much. It's like, it's like... Yeah, it's like you're kinda like, oh, I wanna get it, but at the same time, it's still like... You know, Dude, it's come still on, okay. it doesn't even have the circus throw anymore. Oh, okay, that's true. The circus throw was the best. Ah, Spinny, I shall beat you to the punch. And then punch you with the punch. Or fire. Something like that. Fire yeah. is punch, right? So fire. much violence. Fire is punch, right? Yeah. Oh, well, that backfired. Literally. But <laughs> don't. Had a little stinger for that one, Barry. <laughs> <laughs> like, okay, I'm not gonna start getting like, I'm not gonna start talking about the game grumps or anything. No, that's that's too mainstream. No. This is a hipster channel, alright? Just kill hipster. You know what? Actually, no. I'm already full up. Might as well quit while I'm ahead. Yeah. Yeah. And inside the treasure chests, we find... Thank you for dancing, Kirby. We all enjoy your show, but hurry up. We find the Beam Scroll, a graphic piece, and a secret door key. Now, the Beam yay. Scroll... What's that? I just said yay. Oh, okay. <laughs> Relevancy! But still... Hooray. Um, the Beam Scroll basically just makes Beam a more powerful, a more powerful move. It doesn't add any moves or anything. Just... Nope. Yeah. It's not like the Kirby Superstar Beam where you can, like, charge it and do all sorts of craziness. Okay, that enemy just disappeared on me. I don't know why. Huh. It's like, is he... He must be a spy. That must be the only, only explanation. That looked like a Shadow Master hand, but it really doesn't give you any powers. Like, Kirby and the Amazing Mirror, like, Smash, I love that thing. Yeah, they really love, like, put in all of the Smash Brothers references. Like, one of the bosses in that game is Master Hand. And another one, more, more like a mini-boss, is Crazy Hand. Yup. That's actually really hard to avoid. Case in point. Yeah. All right, it's time for meat. There we go. Meat powers! Introducing the power of meat! Like, it should be just a... Like a... I can just see that, like a new copy ability, because they just run out of ideas. <laughs> and then they announce Kirby's new copy ability. Meat! meat. And it, it's just like a, a symbol of, um... Forget Meat Boy. 
<laughs> Thanks to you, meat. Anyway, this is Wonkers, one of the returning mini-bosses. He's basically the same as in every other Kirby game. Yeah! But, except this time he throws giant coconuts, along with spurts of three. And as always, he gives you the hammer ability! No the surprise ha there. Yep, with the hammer ability you can knock people astray. You can pound giant pegs like that. You can do, like, a spinning spin move. And... You might be wondering why Kirby holds his hammer back like that whenever you hold down the B button. There's a reason for that. We'll get to that later. Yeah! And later. And Matt probably has no idea what I'm talking about. I actually kind of forget. Woo! Professionalism! <clears throat> <laughs> and just like with Hammer, always you can smash the great metal blocks, just like metal and, like, I think fire can now? Rock as well. Or yeah. stone. Stone, rock, same diff. I must destroy all and blocks. And yeah, fire can as well. What do you think I should do? See, I don't remember which path is which. I don't remember... Let's... Let's... You raise me up! You raise me up! Yeah. I hope you're right, because if you're not, you're gonna... You're gonna get I it. I actually completely forget, because one of those is the chest, and one of them is not. Also, this is a new ability. Throw! Basically, like, from uh, Kirby's Return... Uh, not Kirby's Return to Dreamland. Uh, Nightmare in Dreamland. You can, like, suck stuff up and throw it. It... It's basically self-explanatory. Yep. It can just... Although, um, wasn't it, um, a different name in the original Kirby's Adventure, or am I just thinking badly? I think the chest might have been below. Or either that, or it's behind that bush. Yeah, and I screwed it up. Hold on. I'm gonna try to get one of those enemies to respawn. Yeah, there he is. Let's find out what's behind bush number one! It's a Max Tomato. That means I messed you up. Probably. Dang it, Matt! Um, yep. Definitely. See, this is this is why we can't have nice things. <laughs> I say while I pick up a nice thing. Yep. Oh, there's Gordo again. Oh, wait, no. Well, at the very least, Storo. you get to big chat. Get out of my way, you stupid squeak. Err. That's one no thing way. I didn't know, um, cause I, I, I watched your second episode that came out, where, whenever it came out. Um, and I didn't know that they each of the squeaks had the, like, the angry mode. I didn't know about that. It's a learning experience. Ain't it great? Yeah. Shameless plug, go watch that episode right now. <laughs> <laughs> you probably forgot what happened, so you might as well watch it again. Yeah. You've probably missed it. You're just mistaken. How was that a pawn? Gosh dang it, Matt. Mistaken. Ah. Oh. Inside of these two treasure chests, we find... A graphic piece and a, va a vitality piece. I can't English. Anyway, we have... And we got an extra bit of life now. Or rather, he got an extra bit of life now. Yeah! Yeah, they combine into one. Yeah. 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 But thanks to Matt, we have to go back and get a freaking treasure chest. Thanks for that. That was bad. Gosh dang. Well, at least now we know which one it's in. Uh, right? True. true. Yeah. Gosh dang it. Look it on the bright side of things. Yeah. Gosh dang it, Matt. You're hard to you're hard to like, but you're harder to hate. I'll take that as a compliment. It was. Now get out of the way, my freaking meat, you freaking whatever you are. Like meat. I I actually forget his at official name. We meet again. Ha! <laughs> we meet again? <laughs> I know. Uh, puns, puns. Uh, ah. 
Ah! Don't you land on me, you friggin' bonkers! Get off You're me! You're driving me bonkers! Bonkers! Ha! Puns! I'm gonna... I'm gonna wait. I'm just out of range, too. That sucks. Yeah. Bam! He, he, he moves a lot, too, so that's kinda, like, annoying because, um... You can't just shoot fire at him. I know! It's like you have to actually try or something. Impossible. Did we already get that one? I forget. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we already did. See that? It's just the one that's on the lower path. That's the benefit of having a CoCom. You can yeah. remember stuff. Remembering. What is it? Alright. Let's go! You... Oh, I'd rather Don't... you go, because I'm not doing anything. Well, I'm co-coming, that's a thing. Yeah, you need to pull your weight more. Bro, do you but, even... Uh, what if I'm fat, and that's a lot of weight to pull? Bro, do you even lift? Ow. Actually, I haven't been in a while, honestly, but... Stop it! Gosh dang! <laughs> Stop giving him the cold shoulder. I kn he knows he hasn't uploaded in a while. Ah, my face, it's melting. And the chest has to be on the other side of this door. You know, I, I'm curious. What happens if I combine two of these? Same as Just with Max Tomatoes. I get a random. Let's do it. Yay, random. Oh boy, animal. animal. <laughs> Phew! Don't get out of this room! Gosh. Stop it! Yeah, dog. Get out of here. I actually know someone who named their dog Dog. Ugh. By the way, in case you didn't see that, that was the Golden Waddle D. The Golden Waddle D always holds a treasure chest, but is usually on the path to death. You need to, uh... Like, if the Golden Waddle D falls in a pit or lava or something, that's it, you, lo you lose the chest. But, if you can somehow stop it from doing that and get and kill it yourself, the chest is up for grabs. Yay, grabs. Murdering for loot! It's the winner's way. I'm pretty sure they had that in Return of Dreamland, didn't they, or no? Uh, it was like... I don't remember. Well, they kind of did. It was with a key, I think. A couple oh, times. yeah, they had the waddle these that held the key. Yeah. That's all it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I forgot. <laughs> Gosh dang it. It's been a while since I played the game. The last time I played the game was, in fact, when I let's play it. So there you go. And we also got another piece of the map. A Yay, more map. map. That's a now, whatever could be behind this question mark thing? Certainly Find not out. a boss. Yeah. Do you think we get, we got time for one more level? Yeah, I think so. All at right. Least, at the very least, you have time for a boss. I think it's a uh, I think it's a pretty easy boss, especially with hammer. So let's. And go. it's also a boss that appears in like a lot of Kirby games, if I recall. Well, one other, I think. Let's see what that random is. Whoop 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 whoop. Ooh, that'll come in handy. Well, because wasn't... Yeah, this is it. Yeah, um, wasn't she in Mass Attack, too? Uh, she might have been. Either that yeah, or... Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Mystery. So it would have been that and then, um, Amazing Mirror, right? I cheated through that whole fight. <laughs> and I don't feel a bit of shame. <laughs> anyway, that was, anyway, Mrs. Moly. Uh, wife of Mr. Moly, who you fought in... Amazing mirror and thus murdered. So she's taking revenge, except she's dead now. So, kill right. figure. Oh, I didn't realize that was the misses. Okay, so that so you fought Mr. Moly twice and only misses once. I see. Yep. Gotcha. And we now have unlocked World Three. Cushy so now we're cloud. out of the hole, walk down the clouds, and into the clouds. Yep. And we're, we're in a mountain. We're now in a cushy cloud, which is located on a mountain. 
for and uh, uh, and woods and stuff too. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure that just qualifies as fog. Maybe. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it does. Anyway, I think that's probably good for this episode. So on the next episode of Kirby's Whenever Spook that Squad, comes out. Gosh dang it, Matt. <laughs> The... Well, hopefully the whole objective is is that you're going to be editing this video, and then you're going to hear me say whenever that comes out, and then you'll be like, I should make another one. And then you make another one, and then at the end of that, you remind yourself to make another one, and then hopefully that system keeps going, so yeah. Maybe I should just cut you out of the whole video. No! <laughs>